So, today I just wanted to talk about some tools you could use to network. So, TikTok. Useful for networking. I would post stream clips. Things like that. Pull attention to your channel from another platform. So, you could pull people to your channel from another platform by posting clips. That's TikTok. Uh, I mean, you could also post, like, the normal shit people post on TikTok. I just post clips. Hover is a lot like TikTok. Now, it's for Twitch streamers specifically. So, like, this guy posted this clip and you can see that they are currently live. You can visit their page or follow them. It's just another tool you can use to network uh, with other streamers. Instagram, another tool useful for networking. I was chat today. I love this extension, by the way. That's a great extension. Whenever people talk in your chat, It'll uh, calculate the words and stuff and make this cool little word chart type thing. I think it auto updates every hour, eight hours, something like that. So you could make a Instagram, post pictures, something cool, you know. Twitter. Twitter is very useful. Just Twitch. So you would post in, um, Let's try like uh Small streamers connect, small streamer community. You can type in like affiliate grind, anything like that. Hashtags are very, very useful. Make sure to use hashtags in all of your content. Pull people to your platform or to your your channel from another platform, and these are useful platforms for that. Now, Pulse Banner is really cool. So it will change your name on Twitter and your uh, little icon here and your banner. So your your banner and everything. Oh. So it'll change my banner. It'll change my name as soon as I click go live. This will update to live now with a little red icon. This will update to live with a picture of my stream. And uh, then as soon as I go offline, it resets it back to everything that it was before. But that's useful so that whenever you post your tweets, you know, because they're going to be showing up on Twitter even when you're not on Twitter. They're going to be showing up in like random searches because you're going to be using hashtags. We're going to be going through these these little categories or whatever and see that, hey, this person is live and they will click that live stream. This is about embedding your stream in a tweet. So, yeah, it has the actual stream inside the tweet whenever they click it. Normally, it will redirect them to your Twitch page. This will automatically open your stream for them to watch. It's really nice. Uh, super simple, super easy to use. Linktree. Linktree is very useful.